And welcome to Everybody's Gone to the Rapture. Not really sure what this is about, but I'm assuming it's something to do with an apocalyptic world from the Rapture. So, alright, let's go. Do the apocalypse. Yeah. This is Dr. Catherine Collins. I don't know if anyone will ever hear this. It's all over. I'm the only one left. Shit, didn't realize it was already going there. I thought I was still in mid cutscene and then nothing happened. <laughs> I'm going to continue to broadcast for as long as I am able. If I'm right, we should be able to pick up the signal right across the valley. The event left markers. We don't understand it yet, but we're going to keep working to try and understand it. You can use them to find what you're looking for. The answers, they're all here. The answers are in the light. Okay. Does that mean these little pinpoints or something to do with what I need? Um, well, clearly whatever I need to do is not in here. Is there a way to move faster? Phone's not in there. This is a special announcement by the Emergency Measures Committee. Due to exceptional circumstances, radio and television in this area has been brought under the control of the EMC as per the Crisis Preparedness and Action Bill of 1982. Keep your radio and television on at all times. Stay indoors and avoid contact with other people. Do not attempt to telephone outside your local area. Do not panic and remain civil and calm. Stay tuned to this station for updates. Huh. All right. I'm trying to do my job. You two will be the only staff on site for this rotation. I'm just saying, if the main gate's power fails, then there's no way in or out of the observatory. That's why there are backup generators. Jesus, why the hell are we even discussing this? 
Just don't you come running to me if you get locked in. If we get locked in, we won't be able to come running to you, will we? You let us worry about the clever stuff, and you can concentrate on sweeping up leaves and changing light bulbs. Happy? Now piss off. Ah, so. That was unnecessary. Just because you're angry with me doesn't mean you have to take it out on everyone else. Okay, can we just talk about this? Mm. Steven, I'm done. I just want to get out of this place, and tonight is our best chance of doing that. You prep the arrays, I'm heading up to Tower 6. Okay. I love you. Okay. You know that, right? <clears throat> yeah, I know that. Come on, let's get started. Okay. I don't know what that was all about, but... Off we go! So whoever we're playing as here can't run. So everything's gonna kind of take a while. It looks like we're in a town called Yogton. You need to shut down the optical array. It's using the observatory as a conduit to reach us, and it started spreading its range beyond the valley. Kate, we can't afford to let it do that. It's getting stronger. I'm going to call Clive back, and I'm going to force him to order the strike. I just don't see what other choice we have. God knows Clive, if can you hear me? We need help. Who are you? Okay. I don't know what the fuck that was. <clears throat> Guess I'll just keep going this way then. so hard on yourself. We've all had rejections. You haven't. <laughs> Come on. We'll look at the figures, tighten up the data, and resubmit. Your core idea is sound. You just got the number slightly wrong. <sighs> Don't patch. I think you are a brilliant man, Dr. Appleton. Listen. I'm here, right? We're together, you and me. The alignment event tomorrow. It's yours, okay? You saw the opportunity, you ran the numbers. Even if they can't see it. I'm proud of you. Is that supposed to make me feel better? See you then, then. Look on the bright side, uh, around here. <laughs> You're a hero. Prodigal son returns, right? 
I'm surprised they haven't erected a statue in your honor yet. <laughs> oh, you can laugh all you want. But I'll bet the parish council have a subcommittee working on that right now. <laughs> So far, I have no fucking idea what is happening right now. You know, they uh, see me as an outsider here as well. Is that supposed to make me feel any better? You know, I understand it's difficult. That's all I'm saying. Your lot up at Vallis have never mixed with the local community. People here, they don't really understand what you do up there. Are you trying to get me to come to your church? It's not just about faith. It's about the community. Be involved. Be seen as part of it. One of them. <laughs> Good morning, Father. Lovely day. <laughs> oh, hello. Um... Mrs. Appleton, isn't it? It's Dr. Collins. Lady scientist. Whatever next? Good morning, Barbara. <laughs> Father Wheeler. You really think that's a community that will ever see me as one of them? I can live with them staring at me. They just stay out of my way. This is weird. Something's happening over here. Something right? Get out of my way. Where's Kate? Where do you think she is? Stephen, what's going on? Screw Kate. It's all her fault anyway. What's that mark on your face? Stephen! Stephen! Well, I'm pretty sure the person we're playing as here is Kate. So, whatever they were talking about, it must be my character here's fault. Something like that. Notice that you know everyone's gone, but there's still well, birds chirping here. And fishes we can manage, but Father Jeremy, is might I have a word? It's weird, to Mrs. Boyles. Of course. Meg, will you excuse us, please? Uh, see you back at Charlie's later. Cheerio, Wendy. I was speaking to Barbara. She said there were some irregularities about Mary's morphine. Good grief! We... Those are private medical records. Barbara should know better than to be discussing that sort of thing with you. If Dr. Wade finds out, he'll have no choice but to suspend her. Damn it, Wendy! Your brother is grieving. Mary was sick for a long time, and I'm glad it's over for her. Go and support Frank. He needs you now. God knows what you did. He sees. I just break and overlook Mary's weakness, but you, a man of the cloth, you, have an you issue bring with... shame on this parish. If you have an issue with me, I suggest you write to the Bishop of the Diocese. I have parishioners to attend to, excuse me. Hmm. 
Hmm. Guess we'll go check out the church. See what's going on in there. So there's nothing really going on in here. Alright guys, well that'll be about all for this one. Maybe in part two we will see what the fuck is going on here. Thanks for watching and as always, hit that like button, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.